Now this is what you call the money shot. It was almost like a paper shredder. There was just paper everywhere, raining paper. And the cash confetti didn't stop falling. We counted one, two, three. And right before the truck rounded the corner of the 805, toss number four, sending a fortune flying into the air. I saw that it was like $100 bills just flying from the sky. Even before the truck was out of sight, drivers were pulling over to cash in. I saw every, just people running to the, to the freeways. They were risking their lives. We saw men, women, young and old scrambling for cash. This woman hopping out of her car right in the middle of traffic. I mean, I need money, but not that bad. You're going to keep it? Yeah. Not going to turn it in? No, money isn't the street? But when I told this man the money was evidence in a crime, he handed over a 20 to me. How much you got, man? How much you got? <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure. Are you going to keep it? I don't know. Investigators say the chase started just before 5 p.m. when police tried to pull over the driver and he didn't stop. It finally ended about a half hour later when the two suspects were arrested. Money stuck to their truck. So where did the money come from? The DEA tells News 8 all it can say is that this was part of an ongoing drug investigation and it has recovered most of the money. In this bag, San Diego police collected more than $16,000 in cash from officers who gathered what they could. But on this stretch of the 805, just north of I-8, we didn't see much left. What you get, man?